Oh, it's freezing out here. What, it's only nine degrees? Ah, why did I agree to come out here? Sup of the morning to you, ladies. My name is the Randall Man Buck, and welcome back to the landscaping series. Uh, I am freezing my butt off here right now, and yes, that is right. We just spent $117 on diesel for this thing. It was empty. Uh, because of just, you know, tax write-offs and the ability to, in other words, get just some work trucks and whatnot, I actually just invested myself in a 2020 F-350. For this occasion, we're going to have some fun. With this new truck, it will be a helping hand around the shop as well as at home. It is going to be one of my more personal trucks, so we won't necessarily need DOT on it. I'm also going to be looking to trade out the 2018 F-150. We are over an aisle right now. Our shop really has nothing going on right now since it's that late, late fall into, um, in other words, early winter. I know the thing up there says early spring, but that's just how we started up the uh, series, in other words, here. I'm going to be helping out Grant with doing some snow plowing today here, but we're going to have to find a way out because apparently Casey's did not have county the county come out here and clear out the runway. So whatever it is, we're going to make our way over to his shop. Going to be helping him out. I will be showing you guys a 2016 F-150 that I'm going to be getting, but it will have a topper and whatnot. So you guys will get the rest of it, but let's get to the shop. There I can't go. hear you. Now, I can't talk too long because I'll freeze my butt off even more, but... Uh, yeah, shop over in Nebraska right now, we aren't getting a whole lot, it's that like very last part of fall where everyone's technically got their leaves cleaned up, it's just freezing, and I heard okay. you guys got that snowstorm that just came in and whacked it, we're supposed to get some more next week, but I might come out here and help you guys out for a bit, get some hours we Probably. Got, I mean, we probably got over a foot in half a day, it was quick, <sighs> she hit hard, yeah. Well, I wouldn't be surprised, it is 2020. But, you're, I mean, two, you're a two-hander? I see. What? Oh, ten and two. Well, there's a little bit <laughs> sketchy out here on Iowa roads, all right? I can tell you're still holding on. I, it's it's not white knuckles, <laughs> though, all right? It's not white knuckles worthy. It's just I, I'm very scared with this truck. I don't drive trucks, dude. I drive cars. Just so of, vlog, actually, if you guys on. don't while know. You're, while you're at it, hop on in so we don't have to freeze our butts off. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Unlock the door, Buck. I did unlock the door. Hop okay. on in. There you go. There we go. It's unlocked. Okay. Yeah, see, nothing, no heated seats, just really nice heater in the car, in the truck. I see. I'm going to back see. it up here. Hey, I got to go pick up some toolboxes over at the tractor supply. Okay. Could you give me a ride over there? Um, do we want to hold it all back in this, or what do we want to do? I think that'll work. Could you fit two toolboxes? I was thinking about picking up two. Uh, I mean, I can, but I got my toolbox in the back of the truck, so that shortens up the bed length. So, this is going to be your office. Two okay. double monitors. Last employee, caught playing farm sim during work time. Don't mm, do it. That stupid, that stupid idiot. Yeah. Why, why would he yeah. play that game? Hey, he uh, was snow plowing. He was snow plowing. Snow plowing. In a video game. How dare he? Get out here and do the real stuff. And exactly. actually get a job. Uh, exactly. I really like what you did with the place when it comes to decorating, dude. It's really nice. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it. Texaco, Phillips, all Ford signs and deer. Man, this is a great work. This is a great workplace. Did did real nice on that. The only thing we're missing, we need a good toolbox, one rolling, because I always hate having to walk all the way over here for my parts while I'm working at, you know, a different um, shop like across there. You do realize this is just an oversized Home Depot one that's plastic, right? Yeah. I hate that, it. That's probably was probably why you're not having very good tool storage. <laughs> that and you had some paper thin ones. Those are probably gonna snap anyway. But yeah, I'd suggest probably getting some new new toolboxes. That'd be fine. Yeah. So we built this one last year. This is the new baby. Ooh. And there's, yep. Just picked up this 2020 also. So it's an F250 Lariat, six seven Power Stroke. Um, the only thing I don't have is I don't have a blade for it. So oh. we gotta pick that up today too. Okay. Uh, the one thing I'm actually kind of digging is the King Ranch rims on this thing. Actually, doesn't look half bad. Where'd you get them off of eBay? Well, I like those King Ranch over the Lariat rims, so I traded you guys straight up. Let's say I thought you were always more of a little bit bigger rims, because aren't those 20s and the Lariats were like 18s? 
Lariats, you can get 20s. Okay, I did have 18s. I did have 18 inch wow. rims on my Lariat. That was the issue. I was like, I want 20s, and the Keen Ranch rims look real good. Oh, I got you. Either way, it looks nice. I like that. Thank you. Sorry about that. So that was Jimmy called. Plow's ready. Oh, okay. Are we heading over? Where is it at? Okay, so how's this going to work logistically? Can you drive over separate? I'll drive over with my pickup truck because I got to hook up to that plow. Sorry. And then we'll meet at Tractor Supply and pick up a toolbox or two toolboxes. I can fit two of them in my bed uh, lengthwise, as long as they can, in other words, get over the top of the wheel wells. Okay. That'll work good. Okay. Oh, follow me there. I gotta get my truck warmed up, and then we'll get rolling. Right. Should have been sort of prepped, because... Wait, do you have that engine block heater option on that thing? I do. Oh, good, good say, call. Unplug that. Yeah, yeah, I was gonna <laughs> say, I don't want to rip that out. Yeah, drive it away, like... <laughs> You'll see the wall ripped out of the shit. <laughs> Where'd that thing go? <laughs> all right, so we are going to, in other words, help Grant out with getting all of our little things. I'm probably going to be taking that 150 back there if I'm correct. But we are going to make our way over to TSC and go pick up some, uh, in other words, toolboxes. Uh, we do seem a little biased with running only all Fords. We do have a Ram somewhere around it. Oh, it's up on this thing. Yeah, uh, Grant? You got, yeah. Uh, you got a CB in there? I do, I do. Why didn't you show me the ram that's on the hill? I just noticed that. Yeah, the ram on the rock pile. Oh, I forgot to show you that. Yeah. Like, I thought this was an all Ford establishment. I'm like, I swear I saw you something wouldn't, else here. You wouldn't believe how many customers pull in and are like, that is cool. They just say, that's cool. They just stop in and are like, hey, if I'm ever gone, you can still plow our yard. Yeah, welcome to Wisconsin where you drive on the road and you have no idea if we're on the road. <laughs> oh, okay, that is not the driveway. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Whoops. Just bust through there, Buck. You got 4x4. Four four. I do, but I'm also not down to be paying payments on someone's front end by sliding into it. A few moments later. We're going to make our way back, though. Get ourselves set up, ready to go in that little black F-150. And like I said, we're going to help out Grant. Just get the county roads done here. And it should be a really, really fun time. Yep. This is Grant at, this is Grant at Rental Rocket Landscaping. How can we help? Yeah, you can be there in two minutes. It's right across the street. Sounds good. Thanks, Lauren. Okay, Lauren from Casey's called. Uh, David's sleeping in right now. He's oh, not even geez. getting the job no done at Casey's. No wonder he didn't get the job done. So we got to get over there. Okay. And this, this could be our account. Let's roll. Ooh, amazing. Let's, let's We don't roll. have salt yet, though. But, have, yeah, but so the spreaders are useless, but they're extra weight. So that's what I see it as. Does this have that 3.5 or the 2.7 Eco Boost? It's got the 3.5. Be careful, man. She'll spin the tires. I've noticed. I remember I was on the snow the other week with one of these, and it was just... All right, you want me to take lead, or you want to take point? You can take lead. All right. Meanwhile... More just light bars or, like, grill lights. Light bars. All right, I'm just going to, like, you know, clear the right lane here, so that way you can at least even get into Casey's. Okay. Let's see if we can break through here. Gosh darn buck. I should have got the V plow. I mean, do you even know how to run the V plow? I do not. I say I've ran one before. I'm not too good at it. It was last winter when I ran one last. All right, coming in east side. Okay. Your CB is echoing a little bit. Oh, the 150 is not liking the weight. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. I see which fence you're talking about now. At least they got on. At least they didn't get any underneath the pumps. That does help. This is a lot of snow, Buck. You want me to head back to the shop back and get and say, I'll go get that V plow. Yeah, I was gonna say you can push a lot of snow with that. Actually, this one has a better turn radius, so it can be the better cleanup crew. Unless you want to use okay. that truck, I'll take your truck back, and then you can use this one. I I like this truck. It's nice. She's got a lot of power. She's heavy too. Yeah, all right, I'll be back with the Ram. Okay. 20 minutes later. There's Buck. You know what I noticed about this truck? That's turn signals on the bed are more of a strobe light, so technically we do have strobes on one of our trucks. There we go. That's one thing I was wanting to get, is roof strobe lights. Those would be nice, especially at night. Yes. I'm hopefully not going to get hit here within the next few seconds, which I guarantee you I probably will. Hey, Buck, you have that V-plow, right? Can yeah. you come help me? I want to get all this snow cleared away from this fence. 
so I can push it out to you and you can V plow it into uh, the pile. Hang on a minute. This, Wait thing's a more of a, this thing's more of a bruiser. You're more of a cleanup style. Yeah, fuck. Hold on, hold on. I'll pile over for you and you can take her away. That's what I'm doing. I'm already on your right, so watch out. Man, that V plow would be nice right now. With these little scraps. Hold on, Buck. Let me pile into you. Let me pile into you. There you go. Come on, baby. Get it going. Oh! This thing's not liking to scrape the ground very well. I mean, I know Western's not as great of a plow, but it's still... I mean, it's still performing pretty well, but it's it's missing a bit compared to that Fisher. Yeah, that Fisher is good. Better I'm putting the thing straight on the ground, that's probably why. It's not getting in the middle. Never mind. Operator error. Well, if it's okay with you, I might actually head back to the uh, the shop because I got to take a, a press call, a press call, conference call. For okay. Stuff going down at our Nebraska location, so I'll catch you later, bud. Uh, finish up here at Casey's and uh, let me know when you need more help on this, as I'll just be in town the rest of the day. Okay. Sounds good, Buck. All right, see you, bud. See ya. So that's going to do it for this video, guys. Thank you all so much for coming to check this out. I hope to be doing a few more snow plowing vids with Grant and the crew. Uh, we, we are hoping to get possibly one more employee. I think we're going to try to get Jake on because he likes to snow plow a lot as well. But be sure to check out the Boomstick Club for all the up-to-date content. For me and the gang, we're just going to ram right through all this, uh, get that wing out, get rear-ended while we're at it. And I will see you all in the next one. So this is the Rental Man out. Peace. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Blue <Jack>. oh. <laughs> Blooper. Right. Oh my God. I never read it. Oh.